there's my best friend Jack begging me to make this documentary about his life. Some people hate the way they sound, they hate the way they look. No, it doesn't bother me. Oh, by the way, he has a brain tumor. Basically, the news that I got was that I was terminal. I had one doctor tell me I'd be dead in six months. They cut, see, from the center of the head, and they went up around here, and they went in front of the ear. Big chunk of my brain is gone. The tumor has increased somewhat. You want the whole thing on tape? Yeah, completely. Why? Wow, that's insane. We all die at some point. It has to deal with knowing it's going to happen and how you live your life and how you try to accept that death is going to get you. I just got home one day after work and he was like, I quit my job. I'm left with this. Can we have at least discussed it? My God. You are choosing the day that you want to die. And that allows people to die with dignity. I believe he is constructing some sort of delusion around the myth of Jack Teller. Oh my God, that's the house. That's the house I grew up in. The deal with my mom is that she just wasn't here. She didn't really participate. I haven't talked to my mother in probably 25 years. Okay, I'm gonna recall that number and leave a message. Do you think I should do that? He has my parents who love him deeply. You left us behind. Empty heart, empty miss. But he never had a real parent. I never knew my biological father. I tried looking it up on my own. Oh my God. Here's my boy. Okay, was that too well, fast? Oh. Are you still gonna do it? Yes. I've had an incredibly happy life. I'm not just doing it because I'm scared to die, and quite the opposite. Jack is creating his ultimate performance piece, which is leading up to his ultimate demise. You gotta be scared, right? Fuck yeah, I'm scared. You know, I'm here, my whole theory, you gotta do it, gotta do it, gotta do it. I know I gotta do it, but man, when you really gotta do it. I just want you around and I don't want you to do it. <laughs>